Welcome to this uh, Windows channel and uh, this is a uh, little video to answer a few questions that I've been asked uh, quite regularly in the past uh, few weeks. So of course uh, this is the Insider Build 17.115 released yesterday, March the 6th. And um, of course some people have been asking me first of all when this is going to be officially available to everyone so this build of windows is going to be available for everybody in early april is pretty much when i think it's all going to be um we're you know we've got four new builds in the past 12 days so that's very very fast and that also tells us that there's uh we're really getting really close so insiders will get it first and then, um, you know, pretty much everybody else will get it at some point, um, starting early April. Um, one of the things that also is showing us that it's getting close is that there is no known issues from the insider team, although there's a few and I have actually stumbled upon one uh, with the game bar that's not working. But apart from that, um, it's pretty, pretty good and very, um, uh, very stable so it's uh and most people that have been testing it seem to find it very stable also um somebody asked me okay well can i get it the day it actually will be released uh, or will i get it the day that it's actually released so some of you will have it the first day absolutely so when whatever the date is official uh for that version it's um, going to be some people, uh, you know, are going to have it the first day. But some of you will not see it on the first day. It's going to appear at some point in the next few weeks or months after, just like the rollout of Falkyrie or something. You know, it's right now at a little more than 85% of Windows 10 users, which is a very good number, by the way. And um, it's going to do the same thing. It's going to take a certain time. It's going to start slowly and then it's going to go faster and faster. Uh, you know, as, as the, the upgrade people, they will understand that, um, okay, it's, it's going well. So let's, you know, uh, keep up the pace and let's even roll out faster. Uh, so, you know, this is really, really being very close. Uh, we are at uh, just a few weeks away. Um, if you oh, don't see it the first day and, you know, some of you said, well, can I force it? You know, when it doesn't show up on your Windows updates, I always say it's better not to force it. It's better to wait for it. Uh, past few builds or versions of Windows 10 have really shown that most people who had problems were the ones that actually forced it because they wanted to have it right away. There's a reason why it doesn't show up in your Windows updates. It often is because there's something that's just not right or incompatible. And the telemetry uh, lets them know that your PC is ready or not to get it. So if it doesn't show up, it means they know something is not right yet. So you better wait for it. It lowers the uh, chances of adding, having any issues. Another uh, question that I get is, uh, will it slow down my PC? Or will it work with my, you know, five or six year old computer that's running Fall Careers Update? Look, there's no changes at all on the amount and what type of machines are going to run this new version. So basically that means that we are going to uh, basically have the same machines running the next version of Windows uh, 1803. So your old five or six uh, years old machine that's running Fall Careers Update will upgrade to this new version. Um, any machine that is compatible will upgrade and it's not slower. So honestly, it shouldn't slow down your PC really. Um, it works you know, fine pretty much on everything that I've uh, tested it on. It doesn't seem slower or any difference in speed from, you know, the different versions of um, Windows 10 that I've seen in the past. So um, that is for sure pretty much the same. They're, they've been pretty good at keeping the versions uh, really running well and not really requiring more 
resources. Um, so that that is a good thing um, because I mean you know uh, one of the things that we're scared every time there's a new version of Windows is if it's going to be slower on the machine or not. And last question uh, is it really called Spring Creators Update? We don't know. We don't know because Microsoft has said absolutely nothing with this update. That name comes from the fact that somewhere in the code in the insider builds some people have noticed that the name Spring Creators Update is in there. It doesn't mean anything because it's may, it may be just internally in Microsoft they started calling it that. The best I think would be to call it just by its version number. Um, the version number that it has is 1803. Uh, the version number follows the year and the month. So year 18 for 2018, 03 for the month of March means that it's the March 2018 release. Um, why not give it, you know, a numbering um, instead of a name, especially with the very low creativity they have in their names. It might be better like that. And uh, so we're continuing. And um, one last question. Uh, is this the last update for Windows 10? No. There is going to be one this fall. There's going to be one next spring. There's going to be one and so on and so on. I'm, of course, referring to uh, North, the Northern Hemisphere um, here. So it's like uh, there's going to be, you know, something in September, October. There's going to be something in March or April of next year also. And every six months, it's pretty much what we're going to have. Um, you know, there's a skip ahead right now that I'm installing on my machine and uh, that one is the next version for September, October. So we're already seeing that um, sets, for example, is going to come back and maybe be part of that version, you know. But for now, uh, nice new features and uh, last but not least, when will I review it fully? Um, soon. I am not doing it as long as there's a watermark on the bottom right because we are not there yet. Um, but I know that pretty, we're pretty much, you know, at what it will look like. So I could probably use this version and review it and I'd be 99.9% .9 at what it's going to look like, you know, in a couple of weeks for everybody. So uh, that's coming up. So hang in there. Of course, uh, we'll have videos of everything that's happening and the rollout and the dates and all the information required will be there. So uh, don't worry about it. It's coming up. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.